Good evening, everybody. Uneducated economist here. So manufacturing here in the United States has dropped to a level not seen in 10 years. And of course, this really isn't that surprising. If you look out there at the global economy, it doesn't really leave you with a whole lot of trading partners to buy your goods and services from you. And so Donald Trump, who has been screaming at the Federal Reserve to to drop, you know, interest rates and weaken the currency so that our exports would be more cheaper for the rest of the world out there. The rest of the world is going into currency crisis, currency collapse, and currency weakening themselves. And so how much would the Federal Reserve actually have to weaken their currency in order to make up for the fact that everybody is already doing that? It would probably be a pretty significant amount, I'm only assuming. Now, even if they did go to weaken their currency, like say set up some major quantitative easing program or something like that, I feel that that would trigger a mindset across the markets to get out to that there is problems recession is on the rise that something is happening here with the markets or else the federal reserve would not be going into such you know such measures and getting out of the market and getting into cash would also strengthen the dollar doing exactly the opposite of what donald trump would be looking for so I really don't see a scenario in which the Federal Reserve has an opportunity to weaken the currency. I think that no matter what they do, the dollar is going to strengthen from here. Like I said, whether they go to, you know, weaken the currency, spook in the market, getting people to get into cash, or if they just kind of hold pace on where they're going. Because like if you think about it right now, the rest of the world is weakening their currency. That gives carry traders the opportunity to borrow weak in their in their local currency and then lend it to the United States and keep the difference in between. That adds strength to the dollar. Warren Buffett came out the other day saying that he's sitting on a hundred billion dollars worth of cash. I would imagine that a bunch of billionaires followed his lead and along with a bunch of other millionaires and a bunch of other little people who probably, you know, followed his lead as well getting into cash. And now it's not surprising that he said that. And, you know, that art, those articles came out. And then a couple of weeks later, we had the liquidity issues taking place inside of those big banks, causing the Federal Reserve had to step into the into the repo market. So really, I don't see a scenario right now where the Federal Reserve could weaken their currency. I see no matter what they do, the dollar is going to continue to strengthen. Even if they do go into mass printing, I think that in itself would spook the markets into getting into cash. So, you know, believe it or not. Anyway, uneducated economist, you guys let me know.